Hello, my name is Susan Brackman and I'm the Bruce Township Clerk. We have a very important election coming up on August 7th. I'm here today to give you some important information on the voting process and precinct locations for the residents of Bruce Township, Washington Township, and the Village of Romeo. To vote in the August primary, you needed to be registered by July 9th of 2012. If you did not get registered in time, you may still register to vote in the general election in November. Please contact the clerk's office for more information on these deadlines. The August primary has a unique ballot where you must vote a straight party ticket. It is important to understand how the ballot works because we would like to avoid any spoiled ballots. This is especially important for our absentee voters whose ballot could be rejected if filled out improperly. Let me explain further how the ballot is set up. When you look at the front of the ballot, you will notice on the top left there is a section marked Partisan Section. This is a section where you must choose to vote either Republican or Democratic. Once you choose, you cannot cross into the other section. You must follow the Republican or Democratic section all the way down. These sections continue on the back of the ballot. When you turn the ballot over to mark your selections, please stay in the same section you began in the front. If you cross into a different section, your ballot will be invalid. If you are voting in person, the machine will kick back your ballot. We would like to avoid this if possible. You will have the opportunity to vote a new ballot if this occurs at the precinct. If you are sending in an absentee ballot, however, the ballot is spoiled and your vote will not count. It is imperative that you are voting an absentee ballot you understand not to cross over in the partisan section. Once you finish the partisan section of the ballot, you have some additional items to vote on that are nonpartisan. These are along the right side of the ballot and have no restrictions on how you can vote. Now we can take a look at the races and proposals that will be determined during the August primary. The ballot we are looking at is for Bruce Township. Washington Township voters will have similar races but will also have different precinct delegates and will have a police millage renewal on their ballots. Copies of either Washington Township ballots or Bruce Township ballots are available for review at your local clerk's office. On the front side of the ballot, in the partisan section, are the races for Congress, which include your U.S. Senator and 10th District Representative. The county offices up for election include the Prosecuting Attorney, Sheriff, County Clerk, Treasurer, Public Works Commissioner, and County Commissioner. Still remaining on the front side of the ballot, we can move to the nonpartisan side of the ballot where you can vote for Judge of Probate Court, a County Veterans Millage, a County Art Institute Millage, and the local township renewal for the operation of Parks and Rec. Please note that the language for millages should be read carefully. On the back section, there is another partisan section for local officials and precinct delegates. You will be voting on the office of Township Supervisor, Township Clerk, Township Treasurer, and two seats for Township Trustee. Please note that this is a primary and the winner of the Republican and winner of the Democratic Party will go through to the November general election. It is important to realize that for three offices, Supervisor, Clerk, and Treasurer, there is no Democratic opposition for these positions. What this means is that the winner in August will go through to November with no opposition. It's important to know this because three out of the four offices held locally will be determined in August. The Office of Trustee has four Republican candidates running for two seats and only one Democratic running for two seats. The Democratic candidate will already go through by default to the November general election. Remember, in November, you may split your ballot and choose any party without any problem of your ballot being spoiled. Also, on the back side of the ballot for Bruce Township is the millage question for senior citizen transportation. If you have any questions on the ballots or would like to see a sample, please contact my office at area code 586-752-4585. Although we are not allowed to give you any specific information on any candidate or issue, our election staff is prepared and trained to walk you through the ballot so that you fully understand how to vote. For those voters newly registered and new to the voting process, I would like to take this opportunity to congratulate you. It is one of our greatest privileges to be able to participate in a free society where we are able to vote privately without consequence. Please do not feel intimidated. There is no wrong question and we have an excellent, well-trained election staff 
who are friendly and informed and eager to assist you in the voting process. There are nine voting precincts in Washington Township. Precincts 1 and 2 are located at the Capitol Banquet Center. Precincts 2 and 9 are at Stony Creek Community Church. Precinct 3 is at the Grobner Romeo District Library. Precinct 4 is at the Rudgate East Community Building. Precincts 6 and 8 are at the Washington Township Municipal Building, where Precinct 6 is in the Washington Township Senior Center and 8 located at the Washington Township Hall. Precinct 7 is at the Washington Lions Club. There are four voting precincts in Bruce Township. Precinct 1 is located here at the Township Hall. Precinct 2 is located on Morton Street at the Romeo Community Center. 3 and 4 are located at the Orchards Community Church on McKay Road. For those of you voting out at Orchards Community Church on McKay Road, there have been some concerns in the past with the condition of the road. We will make our best effort on Election Day to coordinate with the Macomb County Department of Roads to make sure the road is in good condition. Also, McKay is scheduled to be paved sometime between the August and November election. The Department of Roads has been very cooperative on the paving dates and there will be no construction interference on the August Election Day. Again, if you have any questions on if you are registered, where to vote, or how the ballot is set up, you may call my office in Bruce Township at 752-4585, or if you would like to call Washington Township, you may call Clerk Kathy Boshear's office at 586-786-0012. On behalf of Kathy Boshears and myself, we would like to thank you for the opportunity to get this message out to you, and please remember to vote on August 7th.